I performed in uh, the UK for the first time uh, a few months ago, and um, I wasn't prepared for the experience. All I knew about the UK before going there was um, like World War II movies, where the British officers are always like, the Germans are here, here, and here. <laughs> we should attack them here with a hand here, and a clever pincer movement here, and then quite understood. There was that reference, and then there was um, like Twitter, because I follow a bunch of British people on Twitter, and there's a magical thing that happens in uh, midnight in California, it's 8 a.m. in London, and there's this clash of like late night stoner drunk people that are my friends, and then like morning people in Britain. So like tweet after tweet, there'll be one that's like, um, there'll be one that's like, I just sold a fart for a dollar, hashtag fart dollar. And then right after it, it'll be, Galloway must be sacked! My peace and the Guardian forthwith! <laughs> and you're like, I don't know, I, I gotta side with Fart Dollar on that one. <laughs> I, did, um, I did stand up in Europe, don't do that. Uh, either do stand up or go to Europe, not both at the same time. It's not that they don't understand English, it's that they understand it too well. This is the way a European crowd watches a show. They're like, yes, that is correct. That is the right words you've used. Your adverbs are adequate. We simply find everything about your culture to be boring and inferior. I was in the Dutch part of, the, of uh, Belgium and it's the worst. They're, they're, like, they're like honest and mean all the time. They're like, I hate everything and I'll tell you. After, the, after one of the shows in Belgium, this guy was like, the reason we weren't laughing is because it wasn't funny. <laughs> and that was the host of the show. <laughs> they love to do this thing in Europe. They love to do this thing. They love to pretend that they're more progressive than us. And they'll follow up like a progressive statement with a homophobic gay joke, like one after the other. They love to play that trick. There was a guy who was like, Yes, the reason it's not interesting for us to see a gay comedian is because we already had a gay prime minister 20 years ago. And I was like, oh, wow, that's really advanced. And he was like, yes, he had little fuck boys on the side. Fucky, fucky, fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> Probably for money, like it always is. Ha, 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 ha. And I was like, hold on a second. You're not more progressive than us. You're just a future sci-fi homophobia that we haven't gotten to yet. And he was like, yes, that is correct. I am the final boss level of your little gay rights video game. Yes. When you complete all of the other levels, you get to me, Sven, a European style homophobe who has had sex with a man and simply didn't like it. <laughs> Player one, begin.